Hey guys, RC here back with episode 7, Football Manager 20, home on the Range Rovers. We're at Forest Green and uh, we are nearing the end of the transfer window. Not a lot of activity. We'll take a look at a few things. First off, the schedule, we uh, had a draw with Mansfield, 1-1. Elliot Freer with a goal and then a 1-1 draw with Salford. Aaron Collins found the net again with an equalizer in the 50th minute. Uh, Liam Shepard was hurt in that game, and he will miss quite some time. Let's take a look at the medical center. Uh, Shepard, a sprained knee. He'll be out six more weeks, so that's the biggest loss. And what else? What else? Oh, um, Club Info Affiliates. We finally got the uh, club board to agree to get us a senior affiliate, and it was between Bristol City and Wolves. Uh, Wolves were in the Premier League. Bristol City was in uh, the championship. So just from past experiences, uh, it's hard to get loan players more than two levels, at least for me. So I passed on the one with Wolves, plus they weren't paying us any annual fee. We'll make a small fee from these guys and be able to loan out players. We are currently uh, do, getting team reports to look at some players that we can maybe bring in on free loans uh, because finances are pretty strapped. We did cut our transfer budget down to open up some more payroll room because we did bring in a couple of players. And where are those players? Uh, well, first off, only one new player. Harvey White comes to us on loan from Tottenham. Uh, he is a much-needed central midfielder. Of course, he immediately got hurt uh, after his first match. But he played a 6-8 uh, in that first match uh, in league. Uh, very decent physical. Currently three-star with five-star potential. So definitely room to grow and develop. Uh, solid, solid technicals, penalty taking. He's going to be our penalty taker if we have penalties with him on the field. He can pass. He can take shots. Decent first touch. His mentals are pretty solid. So all around, he's going to be a starter for us. He's going to crack the starting 11, 99% uh, sure. And that's going to put one of our uh, guys, Winchester or Adams, uh, to the bench in all likelihood. And that gives us some depth. Grubb will also be able to come off the bench if we need. So definitely a place that we can, you know, make add some depth for sure. Uh, we also have uh, Marange PG. Uh, we're, we've made an offer to him uh, for, at, with leads to loan him to the end of the season. And we have also gone after Jobin Siu, a right back. Uh, he would be very minimal if we can get him, but uh, basically, you know, he's pretty solid. I mean, he's not great, but he's got really good pace and acceleration, decent marking and tackling. Uh, can't cross the ball as well as I would like for those overlaps, but with the injury to Shepard, we are a little weak. Um, so actually, he's a free transfer. So we've actually got a free transfer offer out on him. So we'll see what happens there. Uh, Pige uh, is with Leeds and uh, another central mid, defensive mid. Very, very good all-around player. And I think would just add more depth and really just upgrade our central mid and I think give us the push that we need down the stretch. That's the hope, at least. So... Anyway, uh, we are playing Sheffield Wednesday. They are in woeful form. So we've, we've got, you know, <laughs> I mean, they're in the championship. They're currently mid-table. But we do, I would say we've got a shot, right? A shot? I'm going to go down to balanced. In fact... I'm going to go with our two defensive midfielders here. We are going to go balanced. 
All right, so Davis, McGinley, Rawson, Bernard, Collins, Hall on the wings, Atchison, Grubb in that central midfield role. Uh, let's see, is there – Kitching is back, Freer, Stevens, Marsh. I tell you what, I think I'm going to – I mean, he's got five-star potential. He's 21. we got to give him a crack at some point. Uh, Mikulski's injured. He comes back to training tomorrow. So, yeah, I, I, some of these guys I just really need to take a look at. So, we'll go with that. Unfortunately, White's injured. Uh, and we'll see. Hopefully, those other guys come back. Uh, all, you know, the new loanies come in. Uh, relatively quickly. Let's encourage the team. Hand over to the assistant. And a kickoff highlight to Wednesday. Oh, there's a nice header out. Collins controls it. Lays it back to Rawson. Now, ooh, it went over. And Atchison breaks through. Takes the... Oh, my God. That was a freebie. That was a freebie. You had to score that one. Get creative. All right, head her down. We put him under pressure. A oh, nice one. We're controlling that midfield with the, oh, over the top hole. Can't beat Dawson in the goal. Dawson makes a big save, and we should possibly be up 2-0. Oh, cleared out. A little bit of a pinball effect there. We're not looking bad. Oh, they're uninterested. Uh, let's show some passion. No, they're frustrated. All right, wrong, wrong shout. Oh, they get the throw-in highlight. Yorfa. I think that's the right. Oh, and Alessio de Cruz. At least it's not his first goal of the season. It's number 10. That cross over the back line. Show some passion. All right, Rawson. Collins in space. Uh, he gets it poked away. That's not good. All right, headed down. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Hold on. Um, in possession. I'm going to say dribble less. I'm going to say dribble less because, oh, nice ball over the top. And Atchison slots it home. His sixth of the season. Lloyd James in the midfield with the assist, and we are back on even footing at one. I think they're just going to be a more talented team than us. So if we if we dribble less and just go more for straight passing, that may do away with some of these issues of losing the ball. We'll see. We'll see. I haven't done that before, so that's just a guess on my part. Oh, no, no, no. That was a dive. That was a dive. Oh, that's bullshit. <laughs> dive. He freaking did a Grealish. Keeper made a nice try on that ball. Barry Bannon puts it in, his second goal of the season. And Wednesday back on top. Uh, I'm going to encourage them. Straight to a kickoff highlight. That's always concerning. Back to the keeper. All right, there's Collins. He's got the overlap, doesn't take it. There's a good ball, Bernard. Atchison sends it high over the net. Some good ball movement. That was encouraging. We're actually right up there in possession, shots. I'll tell you what, 
Uh, let's flip over here. Yeah, let's do that. Pep talk. Uh, appreciate the efforts. Everybody looks good. So one of the things I don't do, uh-oh, uh, bruised ankle. He's rebounding quickly, but he now he's anxious. Let's go ahead and pull him off. Let's go ahead and bring, let's bring Freer on that side. That's our regular backup. McGinley's on a yellow. Rawson is anxious. Davis is not playing well. Let's go ahead and put Kitching out there. We'll pull Davis off. All right, let's uh, let's tell him to get creative again. Oh, he just lumped it. A big root one, and ooh, it just goes wide. Thankfully, so. Just let me know in the comments below. Uh, looks like uh, Premier League fixtures were released yesterday. I know not everybody's a Premier League fan. I wasn't until this year, uh, of course, with leads going up. But looks like kits are starting to be released, and uh, fixtures are going are being released. So let me know in the comments what do you guys think of your kits this year for your club. Uh, you know, what fixture are you looking forward to? Who do you guys open with? Things of that nature. And let's see. Come on. All right. I think we're going to pull Collins. Let's go ahead and pull Atchison back for Collins, and then we'll bring Stevens up top. That'll be our last sub of the game. Doesn't look like we got anything. Um, you know what? We're already losing. Let's go up to attacking. Should have done that five minutes ago. Long throw into the box. Headed in. Oh, a penalty. A penalty. It's James. Oh, and he slots it home. All right, let's go back to uh, let's go back to balanced. Seventh goal of the season for Lloyd James. Are we looking at extra time? Uh, is that going to be a replay? I think that's going to have to be a replay, yeah? All right, we do appreciate the efforts. All right, let's see what that does. I think it's a... Gary Monk. Ugh. All right, so let's see. All right, let's look at our schedule. So does that get us? Yes, there's a replay. I tell you what, let's go ahead and come back for that. Let's go ahead and do the replay uh, since it's an FA Cup. And uh, I'll go ahead and get these two matches played off screen. So we'll see you guys back here in just a second. So between... Matches. We beat Carlisle 3 0. Harvey White returned from that injury. Our new Loney, he got a goal. And Jack Aitchinson with a brace in the first half. Grimsby played us tough. Uh, they did have a player sent off in the 24th minute. Aitchinson had already scored. And strangely enough, we were unable to put them away. Uh, but we did get the win. So competition wise, we are now at the top of the playoff. Uh, list. We're only two points behind Crawley, Crawley in, uh, for the automatic promotion. And the reason for that, uh, if we look at form, last five games, maybe? Yeah, we had the two draws. They got two wins, and they made up a little bit of ground on us. So that hurt a little bit, but we're playing well. Uh, we are playing well. So that is good news. Uh, let's see. Rob Hall is going to be back. Mikulski's coming back. Not quite ready to play. His match sharpness is down. But uh, he might be good enough at 91 that he, he'll make the bench. And George Williams has recovered from his broken leg. Uh, I want to 
available for U23s until match fit uh, 45 minutes for him. Just to get him back to match fitness and get some match sharpness. Uh, he's one of the you know, the elder statesman at 24 on the club. He could play a lot of positions, so it would really be nice to have him back. And he's pretty good. You can see he's playing a seven and a half in non-competition uh, since recovering from his injury. But, you know, I think he's got a few matches, maybe a couple of weeks before he is back up to snuff to step into the starting 11. All right, we're playing Sheffield Wednesday again. We are at home. I am going to go ahead and continue on with this. So we're going to go with Davis and Rawson at fullbacks, Kitching and Mills in the middle, Smith in goal, uh, James at defensive mid, White and Pige, Pilge will be the new midfield. That's our new midfield combination. Hall, Atchison on the wings, Collins up top, and that puts Winchester and Grubb on the bench. McGinley's out suspended. Shepard is injured. Bernard does not make the bench today, and that's a little surprising. Ibu Adams is on a yellow. He is not on the bench, but that's just due to his overall condition. And I think most everybody else, yeah, Dawson's off. off. Mondal March, so kind of a new look. It is a cup, so it'll be interesting to see how these new signings uh, transfer over to the um, to the league stuff. And if we take a look here, so we knew we had brought Harvey White in on loan from Tottenham. Uh, Jobin Sue comes in on a free. He's a 20-year-old English right back. He can also play left back, but he is right-footed. He's got pace, acceleration, marking, tackling, so he's a solid defender. Needs to work on the crossing, but he has good leadership, so maybe he can develop a little bit. And, you know, if you can get an English player relatively cheap, English players are the ones you can sell for the most money, right? Uh, we also brought Pilge from Leeds on loan, another uh, raid of Leeds United. So, yeah, he's he's pretty good. He's a 23-year-old Croatian, very good physicals. Very, he's just he's just good, and he can play left back, left attacking, right attacking, central mid, defensive mid. Uh, central mid is his regular position, but he gives us a lot of options. So I do like that. And uh, Adrian, and that's who we picked up to replace uh, the other guy that we sent back. And another free is Adrian Pettifer. Uh, he's 17. This is somebody our director of football brought in. And I said, eh, you know, he's only two and a half star potential, but he's 17. He's got some pace. He is English. So let's see if we can develop him a little bit and maybe sell him. So I went ahead and let that transfer go through, but he's going to be on the uh, the younger club. And let's go ahead and get to the match. So we lucked out. I think, you know, it was kind of lucky getting the draw with Wednesday last time. Let's go out and prove a point. They are motivated today. That's good. All right, let's see. Are we going to manage a shot? All right, they get two quick ones. We take the long throw. It's headed out, and they are on a counter opportunity. Oh, he just blows through. Come on, somebody cut him off. Good save by the keeper. Neither one of our defenders cut the angle on him. That's, that's disappointing. All right, there's a good header out. Can Hall get to it? He does. All right, he's showing some pace getting to the outside, but a little too heavy a touch. Taken away. Collins, good first touch. Crosses. Oh, look at that. Right off the foot. Hall cuts it inside, and he was looking for the top bend there. Unlucky, but that was a good move on our part. Let's get a little creative. All right, they are inspired. They're focused. We've gotten them a yellow card on Bjorner. Or, yeah, I'm guessing it's a Bjorner. Not sure. Um, possession were there. We aren't creating a lot of shots. 
So let's build up to positive. Lost and recovered. Okay, so let's dribble less. We tried that last time. It seemed to have worked really well. Be more disciplined. Let's do that. I'm not unhappy with the defense, so I don't want to change anything there. Go out and prove a point. No kickoff highlight. All right. So they're playing with more caution. We've stepped it up to positive. We've got a throw into the box. Take it. Take it. It's there. No, no. Come on. You had to put that one away. He put it right at the keeper who's able to flip it over the goalpost. Take the shot. Oh, that was blocked. And nothing comes of it. Oh, no. Adam Reach, his sixth goal of the season, puts them up. On a set piece from a corner. That is not good. All right. Uh, let's see. Leaf Davis. Let's bring Chris Stokes on for him. Rawson. Collins. Uh, boy, Atchison's playing really bad. All right. Let's bring Freer on for him. And do I want to move? I'm going to move Hall up top. He's not playing much better. Let's show some passion. All right, they're fired up. This doesn't bode well. Over the goal. I think that's the only way to stop a goal on a set piece is if they screw up. That's what I think. All right. Collins. Let's bring Grub on for him. There's a set into the box. Oh, my God. And Mills. All right. We're going to open it up and go attacking. And we are going to demand more. Can we get the ball? No. All right. They're on the attack. There's a square in. Head it out. Oh, there's a nice ball. Hall runs onto it. Was it pushed wide or did he just miss it? Looks like he just missed it. Damn it. We've had some opportunities here. We're going to go assertive. Let's do that. Oh, that is... Pills makes his debut. Valued at $1.4 That's nice. All right, so... We're out of all competitions with the except, you know, so we can focus on the league now. And we are in basically the final two and a half months. So let's, let's come back. Uh, hmm. We've already seen crew several times, right? I'm going to let me kind of look and see how we're playing. I'm going to go ahead and finish out the month. We'll either come back probably like mid you know swindon northampton i think that would be good because that's a mid-table club however if we've gone on a run right if we've gone on a run of wins and we've jumped into that automatic promotion spot then maybe we come back for crew and cheltenham i don't think we've seen cheltenham yet i know we've seen crew but they are top of the table so We'll either come back right at the beginning, and then we can come back maybe the beginning and the end, or you know, Cheltenham, Plymouth, and then Cambridge, Colchester to close out the season. We'll see. But it'll depend on where we're sitting in the table. If we've made it into automatic promotion, I may hold off till the crew match. Uh, maybe we do Morecambe and crew, and then uh, still do Plymouth, Bradford. We'll see. But you know me, I play it by ear. If you like what you're seeing, let me know in the comments below. If you're new to the channel, hit that like and join buttons. Uh, don't forget to hit the little uh, notification bell so you get updates for new uploads. Uh, I've got enough videos out since the computer fiasco. Um, 
So you can see we're running Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday for Football Manager, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday for my secondary series, which right now is Graveyard Keeper. Uh, so check that out if you haven't. And uh, we'll go from there, guys. Thanks so much. We'll see you next episode. Bye.